The mystery for me as someone vaccinated, Professor, is the idea that if I choose to be unvaccinated, how sick is sick when I get the Delta variant? What's the level of sick we should expect? Well, the data is is really rolling in now that um, the Delta variant is causing disease primarily in unvaccinated populations. And the disease that it's showing seems to be a bit more severe than the disease we saw in similar age groups at the beginning of the pandemic. So if you're unvaccinated, the risk from Delta variant is greater of infection, and there's also going to be a slightly greater increase of severe disease from infection. So there's nothing good about being unvaccinated when you think about the Delta variant. Where are we on the vaccination process right now? I follow the statistics. I saw something age over 12, fully vaccinated, 50x percent as well. Are you pleased with the rate of vaccination? Uh, every vaccination is a good thing. I would love to see these vaccination rates get much higher than they were than they are right now. Um, we've reached a stage where many of the people who are uh, vaccinated now, obviously, they're protected from infection. They're protected from severe disease. We haven't reached those levels that really give us a population-based benefit from vaccination yet. That's that herd immunity thing that you hear about all the time. Uh, it doesn't mean that the vaccine doesn't work against you individually. With vaccination helps helps protect you. But at some level, we get that added benefit that the virus is just so difficult to, to, to circulate in the population because of vaccination that even the unvaccinated um, get a benefit from that. We're not close to that level. And as a research scientist, that's what I really like to set as a, as a, as a standard uh, vaccination goal. Yeah, doctor, a lot of talk now about sort of what the next step is for those folks who have uh, been fully vaccinated. Pfizer, of course, uh, coming out yesterday and talking about uh, the idea of a booster shot. The CDC saying that, well, maybe not quite yet here. Where do we stand? Well, all the data so far from the U.S. looks like vaccination, particularly vaccination with the mRNA-based vaccines, is protecting against Delta variant. So... I like the fact that Pfizer has gone forward with the clinical trial to show what a booster will do. Um, I think that's important data to have. I don't see it as an eminent thing uh, in terms of a guidance for the U.S. population. But this virus moves quickly. Variants are merging fast. And I think the Pfizer move is good in terms of preparing for the future. If we get a variant that's even more deadly than Delta, then a booster may be an important thing to, to, to consider. And having Pfizer um, completed the clinical trials for that <clears throat> is going to be a good thing in terms of yeah. helping us be prepared for that.